I really like, um, I guess, the revelation that comes from investing in students. I like the revelation that students get by absorbing something new. Um, and I like throwing out curveballs and challenges. So yeah, I've, I've always been interested in education. Humanitarian engineering is, uh, well, it's not really a new subject anymore, but it's a biannual subject where we take engineers and we give them a real world problem that they actually have to fix. They're going to Rwanda um, and they work in genocide affected communities where they will do an infrastructure project where they actually have to build something that's solving an actual problem um, on site. This is about developing emotional intelligence. The better you are at that, the better you'll be in your career. On top of that, it's actually about giving back a bit. So what we, I guess what we want is we want you know, these students to be able to understand the gift that they actually have. They can change lives, like a civil engineer, for example, by doing proper sanitation can prevent cholera. A mining engineer in, in developing countries I've experienced for, firsthand brings immediate infrastructure. There is a direct correlation between the provision of power, for example, and, and the reduction in poverty. So we're able to take our day job as engineers and give hope to people who, who, who may well be hopeless, um, who are living in that day-to-day -day subsistence environment. But yeah, we have a good hit ratio with graduate recruitment. We're two from two for the Chancellor Hope Memorial Prize. So the 2016 recipient was a member of this subject and the 2018 recipient as well. So yeah, we're going for the 2020 as well. We're introducing a humanitarian minor. Essentially, again, your day job is to be an engineer or whatever it is. And then your other job that you use your existing skill set for is to go and work in a humanitarian space. It gives purpose. We're offering another subject in spring, and that's known as a humanitarian studies. That's an interdisciplinary subject. So we take the basics and the foundations of essentially humanitarian work, um, and we mix an engineer, an economist, uh, you know, business studies, a lawyer, you know, arts, political science, everybody, nursing, medicine, and we, we make teams up of those. They will have to work together to come up with a solution. That will constitute what we call our first subject, our introductory subject to humanitarian work. Then the other subject that we're already doing will be, um, will be our capstone subject, and then we'll have um, two other subjects in the middle which we're developing at the moment. So that will then entail a humanitarian minor into the University of Wollongong.